Yo, it's that bro Naz, dropping another how-to video on y'all. In this video, I'm going to be making turkey bacon pancakes. Um, as you see, here are all the ingredients here that you're going to need. You're going to need, obviously, your turkey bacon, whatever seasoning, salt, and pepper, you know, to season it to your liking, if you, you know, want to do that. Um, whatever you know, bacon mix you uh, need. I prefer to use the one that just uses, that just only needs water, but I like to zhuzh it up a little bit. I like my pancakes to have a little bit of cinnamon in it. I advise maybe like a, maybe about a teaspoon of cinnamon in your uh, batter. You know, that's pretty much all you need. And I like to add a little bit of a uh, Cold Stone uh, sweet coffee creamer to the mix, just to give it a little bit more, you know, fluffiness from the milk and uh, to give it a little slight sweetness to the almost makes it taste like French toast uh, um, pancakes. But um, this is pretty much all the ingredients you need. We'll get into uh, the setup in a second. Basically, you combine one cup of uh, batter here, two thirds cups, two thirds of a cup. Now I'm gonna say about a half of a cup of water and then maybe like uh, about an eighth of a cup of um, the cream and then you know like a teaspoon of sugar and then you you know add all your ingredients into a bigger cup mix it up and it should be this consistency this is the consistency that you want right there okay and this is what it should look like boom there's your batter and as for cooking the bacon you're just going to take whatever frying pan you want and cook your bacon to your desired doneness and add, and if you if you uh if you so choose you can add um you can sprinkle a little bit of seasoning salt and pepper on top of the bacon like as soon as you lay it across the pan that's when you want to sprinkle the seasoned salt and, and pepper across it however much you want to add so that way it cooks into the bacon okay i got the bacon on and i'm gonna hit it with a little bit of seasoning salt as you see, just season it to your liking. There's no no science to it. Hit it with a little bit of pepper. There's no method to the badness. There's no right or wrong amount. It's just whatever, however much seasoning you like. And uh, that's the bacon process. So I'm gonna let that simmer on this side and flip it over. Okay, I just flipped the bacon over and I'm gonna hit it again with a little bit more seasoning salt on the other side. And we're good to go. Um, that's all we need. We don't need to go too much on it because, uh, you know, you don't want to be too salty, you know, but I know that this is going to be going into my pancakes. So I need to be a little salt so that way it's going to balance out with the salty and sweet. And then we in now. Okay, that's about my level of crispiness that I like. About to go ahead and pull these bad boys off. Put them over here. Yeah. Yeah, that's it, baby. That's it right here. This is that done done. Next is the pancakes. Next is the pancakes. That's how I like it, baby. Next is the pancakes. Okay, now that I pulled turkey bacon off, I'm gonna use the same skillet. And I'm gonna hit it with the, the non-stick spray. You know, don't be stingy with it. And then basically, you know, I gotta make sure you have your flipper. Got my big boy flipper. I call it Flip Daddy. You know, a little play on Trick Daddy, the rapper. But this bad boy is big. All right. Got that, at my, got that at an optimal temperature there. And basically, what I'm gonna do is take my batter and I'm just gonna pour it on in there. One nice big pancake. As you see, it's starting to cook. That's how I want it to be, like that. That's good. Put that in the sink. Then I want to take a couple pieces of bacon. Now I take my turkey bacon and I put it in the pancake, like so. Take another piece of turkey bacon, 
put it in the pancake. Another piece of turkey bacon, put it in the pancake. Just like so, you know, depending on the size, you know, if you get a bigger pancake, you put four, but three is good. <clears throat> and then you let that cook, you know, the bubbles are rising, so that's gonna be ready to flip in like another minute. And then I'll show you what it looks like when I flip it over. Okay, we back up in, about ready to flip. You know, I like mine a little bit more well done. This is how I do. Use flip, use flip daddy, pick this pancake up, and it's gonna flip it over. I'm gonna try to do this one-handed, so bear with me, guys. I'm not left-handed, I'm really right-handed, so hopefully this doesn't turn to chaos here. Oh, and I managed to pull it off, just barely. And I get that bad boy in there, so flip that bad boy over. It's in there, let that cook all the way through, then I'll show you the finished product. Okay, now we're all done. This bad boy's all cooked. Now to take flip, daddy. Flip this bad boy over just so you can see what it looks like, the finished product. Whoa, look at that. How good does that look? How good does that look? Now keep in mind, you can cook this to your desired doneness. I like mine a little bit more done because I like it crispy. But, yo, this is going to be banging right there. That's going to be so banging. The good thing about it is got mad extra bacon. You know what I'm saying? I, I got mad extra bacon to add to it if I want. But this right here, this right here, this right here is going to be banging. I hope this works out for you. And uh, that being said, I'm Dat Bro Nez. Turkey bacon pancakes. That's what I'm making, and I'm out this piece. Turkey bacon pancakes, turkey bacon pancakes. Take turkey bacon and you put it in a pancake. Turkey bacon pancakes, guess what I'm making? Turkey bacon pancakes. Turkey bacon pancakes, turkey bacon pancakes. Take turkey bacon and you put it in a pancake. Turkey bacon pancakes, guess what I'm making? Turkey bacon pancakes.